Hello everybody. Welcome to Getting Over It by with Bennett Foddy. All right. So, um if you have no idea what this game is, then uh you've been living in a gutter for the rest for your for all your life and um honestly, you shouldn't be here if you don't know what Getting Over It is. All right. So, this is a game about a man in a pot with a hammer trying to climb a mountain and um it's a rage game i have never played rage games apart from fortnite in my life and i have no idea how i'm going to do so hopefully i do well let's just jump straight into it hello there mr potman oh Oh. Oh, this is the first time I'm playing getting over it. <clears throat> oh, oh, oh my. God. I need to I need to increase that sensitivity. Okay, you know what? I, I, this is what I'm going to do. Uh slow, slow, slowly, slowly. And bam. Oh no, that 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 isn't it. So that didn't work. that did um how how there's how no feeling more intense than starting over there he is if you deleted your homework the day before it was due as i have or if you left your wallet at home and you have to go back after spending an hour in the commute if you want some money at the casino and then put all your winnings on red but it came up black yeah you got your best shirt dry cleaned before a wedding and then immediately mm-hmm. dropped food on it. Well, that's that's you want an argument probably with a friend, very and then later discovered that they just returned to their original view. What starting over <clears throat> is harder than starting uh-huh. up. If you're not ready for that, like if you've already had a bad day, then what you're about to go through might be too much. Feel Now I'm having a great day. Back. I am having a dandy old time. The mouse sensitivity needs to be at a high. All right. Thanks for coming with me on this trip. Yes, no, you're welcome. If you have to take a break at any point, just find a safe place to stop and quit the game. And don't worry, I'll save your progress always. Even Please do. Uh, no. How about no? All right then. My hammer. Me? No! 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 I'm just sending it. I'm just gonna try and send it. No 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 Watch this No 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 take it time take it time take it take it time There you go This is a homage to a free game no. that came out in 2002 titled Sexy Hiking The author of that game was Jazzo a mysterious Czech designer who was known at the time as the father of B games B games are rough assemblages of found objects Designers slap them together very quickly and freely, and they're often too rough and unfriendly to gain much of a following. They're built more for the joy of building them than as polished products. I I don't know what you said. I'm I'm trying very hard to concentrate. Doing fairly well. I I feel like I'm doing fairly well, you know. What? Unfortunate. I... Oh, oh, look at him dance. This man is a strong man. <laughs> It's getting to me. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. I kind of felt it getting to me there. I'm not going to lie. I, I What? Ah, ah, yeah. Yeah. All right. I have a plan. What? Ah, and it almost worked. And it worked. Okay, that not how I intended it to work, but sure. Oh, oh please. No, no, do not slip. Yeah. No. <clears throat> In a certain way, Sexy Hiking oh. is the perfect embodiment of a B game. It's built almost entirely out of found and recycled parts, and it's one of the most unusual and unfriendly games of its time. In it, your task is simply to drag yourself up a mountain with a hammer. And that act of climbing in the digital world or in real life has certain essential properties that give the game its flavor no amount of forward progress is guaranteed so 
jump cliffs are too sheer or too slippery. And the player is constantly, unremittingly in danger of falling and losing everything. So how is that different from this game? Similar, he said. Anyway, when you start sexy hiking, you're standing next to this dead tree that blocks the way to the entire rest of the game. I'm a god. I'm it might take you an hour to get over that tree, and a lot of people never got past it. You prod and you poke at it, exploring the limits of your reach and your strength, trying to find a way up and over. And there's a sense of truth in that lack of compromise. Most obstacles in video game worlds are fake. You can be completely confident in your ability to get through them once you have the correct method or the correct equipment or just by spending enough time. In that sense, every pixelated obstacle in sexy hiking is real. The obstacles in sexy hiking are unyielding, and that makes the game uniquely frustrating. But I'm not sure Jazzo intended to make a frustrating game. The frustration is just essential to the act of <laughs> no. and it's authentic to the process of building Stop a game. Stop talking! Economy. Please! Uh, now I see why it's so... Building this mountain. I'd have an idea for a new obstacle, and I'd build it, test it, and it would usually turn out to be unreasonably hard. But I couldn't bring myself to make it easier. It already felt like my inability to get past the new obstacle was my fault as a player rather than as a builder. Imaginary mountains build themselves from our efforts to climb them. And it's our repeated attempts to reach the summit that turns those mountains into something real. A lesson when you're for building life, a video game world, friends. you're building with ideas. And that can be like working with quickset cement. You mold your ideas into a certain shape that can be played with. And in the process of playing with them, they begin to harden and set until they're immutable, like rock. And at that point, you can't change the world. Please. Not without breaking it into pieces and starting fresh with new ideas. Just, Jay, I'm just, please, just go for it, honestly. How do you do this? No, 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 why are you sipping? No, 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 no. Patience is key. <clears throat> that almost dropped me all the way down. My hand hurts, alright, my hand hurts. Oh no. <laughs> Did she just say, oh no. What? Slowly, man. Slowly, slow. You've done this part before. You know it's possible. Just do what you did the first time. Don't think I'm trying. What do you mean? I see why he's so annoying. Oh. 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 No! Uh. No! Oh, you just lost a lot of progress. That's a deep frustration. A real punch in the gut. Get out of my fucking face here. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs>